What's your name? His name? Severio. Matt. Mike. Okay, cool. So this game is just like hockey, eh? Like these guys are rough out there. Oh my God, banging each other's in the middle of the chair. So you said something about somebody suited up a chair. Because that would be the first thing I would do. I would suit up my chair like to have like extra batteries and extra like gears. <laughs> so have you ever came that cross? Have you ever came across in your mind when you did, when you're playing? Uh, well, I, I tried, but all of our chairs are basically all the same. Like some chairs go to a maximum of nine, yeah. and some of them go 8.5, so it's similar. Okay. But majority, but the majority of them go about six. Is there a rule, a set rule in in the game to? Uh, they're, they're trying to put it in place yeah. that you can't go more than nine because it makes it unfair for all the other players. Yeah. They want an equal playing field basically where everybody is at the same skill level. So that one guy like Severia, for example, who has a lot of still had a faster chair, yeah. there would be no chance to stop them. <laughs> so. Now, have any of these guys gone to nationals at all? Or provincials? Or how does that work? How does it work with your league? American tournament. Whoa! Yeah, every, every two years there's a North American tournament with um, uh, U.S. teams and Canadian teams and it's um, homed at one of their um, um, areas of, of living. Last year was Minnesota. Last year it was Minnesota. Minnesota. It was, and what, what happens in our league is we have tryouts and at the end of a couple of weeks there is a set team that has made the team for that tournament. Um, Saverio has gone to two tournaments so far and last year was my first time going out of three times trying out. Okay, so when it comes to hockey, because you, you normally watch hockey too? Yeah, you do, eh? Okay, so do you watch, are you a Toronto Maple Leafs fan? Yes, die hard. Die hard. Nothing could happen that I'm not going to be a Leaf fan. Uh, I wish I was the same way. I haven't given up on the Leafs. Oh, really? When you get rid of Tess and Sinus, and then I'll start watching. But you want to get rid of the I second hate, round pick? I hate to say it, I might start watching the Habs. Yeah. So you scored like two goals today? I don't know exactly, but it was at least two goals for sure. So, um, are you, because you seem to be the strongest of the players in your team. Are you the captain or what? I'm, there's not necessarily any captains, and it's not necessarily that I'm the strongest. I'm the one that's been playing the longest. So, yeah. So I've got the experience trying to teach the younger guys. How long have you been playing? I've been playing a total of about 12 years. 12 years, wow. Yeah. So you've been here from the inception of? Uh... Yes, I've been, I've been here from the inception. When we had junior league, I was coaching the junior league and playing in the seniors. So I don't do that kind of stuff. So what's the strategy of the game though, seriously? Is it just like hockey or is it just it's quite different, it's obviously? It's actually just like hockey. Yes, all, the, all of our rules are adapted so that it, it can relate to a wheelchair, but it's all NHL rules. Any rough, like when it comes to roughing and checking and all that stuff, is there rules for that? Oh yeah, there are rules for that. I got, that's what I got thrown in the box for today. I got, I got called on roughing and another teammate, Mike, got called for interference and so. Are you the only girl that, were, uh, that plays uh, regularly in the teams or? Um, no, there's about 10 of us, I think. Girls spaced out between all six teams. Well, you really show the guys today. I mean, three, two goals and the penalty, hey. You're doing pretty good. You're like Ty Domi here. <laughs> I gotta admit, the girls are better than the boys here, so. <laughs>